Righty -o guys, so we are out at St. Arnold. We've just uh, travelled up. I'll tell you about it while I'm bloody riding along. We've just stopped here because we're now into the dirt. We're in Karakara National Park, right up the north end near St. Arnold. And uh, we're heading south, gonna camp it. I'll tell you all about that. So, Nay in the Jeep, Pilot Pete on the DR650. Shout out to Chirpy. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> um, Holmesy on the bloody KDM 790. Bob on the uh, the Simpson Desert Rival <laughs> DRZ400. We're going to have a closer look at that because it's looking real smick. Uh, Hal on the DR650 had troubles. I'll tell you about that at the start. We've got Des on the DRZ400, and we've got John on uh, the XT660. Chappy's old bike. It's a better bike now, though, isn't it? <laughs> and of course. I'm on Max, right eight, we'll see you on the track. Righty guys, so I think we're on the center track. This is a real easy track, two wheel drive, no worries. So basically we've uh, ridden from Bendigo, everybody met at HQ. Uh, Hal and his DR650 had bloody troubles. He put 98 and then all of a sudden, oh, hang on a minute, where are we going, where are we going? Where are we going? I think we're going this way. This bloody corner man. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Shit. Stop. Going the bloody wrong way, guys. There you go, you get to see some bikes. Supposed to go. Which way are we supposed to friggin' go? It must be this way. There's no track that way. What am I doing? There we go. There yeah, we're on it. Cool. Oh. So, corner man. Um, yeah, so how? filled up at Ravenswood and he put 98 in his bike and then from straight from there he had all these issues he struggled to get to our place so he had to pull everything out he pulled the carby out had a look couldn't really see anything uh, wrong and um, so we, we got rid of that fuel out of his tank and I had 10 litres sitting there put it in went and filled it up and it all started up and it's been great ever since so that was our first issue Holmesy, bloody on the KDM, he come off. Oh, so we then headed towards Tarnagulla. We did some dirt through there to Tarnagulla. And then the highway, then up Mount Maligal. Some of you guys will know Mount Maligal. We've been there before. Up the top, down the back of it. And then took the highway all the way to um, St. Arnold. We stopped, bloody grabbed some stuff at the bakery and all that shit. And now we've just jumped on the tra on the trail. So now from St. Arthur we are heading south, straight down. And this goes all through uh, Karakara National Park. So I've just, late last night I was bloody, because this is a tag along ride for the crew guys. Um, it was last minute, Pete had rang me up on, uh, I think, Wednesday night or Thursday, I don't know, something. Anyway, I ended up going, well, we'll just do a tag along and we'll do a camp. <laughs> right, hey, quick, we've got to get this up on the crew site and who we've got is who we've got. So a bit late notice, but um, yeah. So we're going to be camping at uh, Tennington Reservoir. There's a campsite there, designated campsite, and they've got, uh, I believe, drop toilets there. I've actually been to Tennington Res before with Nay in the Jeep. We've done some of the further down track. So a lot of this here is flat. Yeah, obviously undulations, but as we go further south, that's when we'll get into the higher country. And now this is, I would call this a gentleman's ride. Yeah, we're just taking it easy. It's just, you know, we're not bloody racing or anything like that. Just out for a ride. And uh, yeah, we'll end up with camp and we've got the grog on board. 
we're all cooking stuff. Everybody's self-sufficient. So it should be pretty good. Temperature's going to be bloody great overnight. Rightio, I'll see you a bit further on. I think I've bloody told you everything I had to tell you. Oh, that was the other thing I had to tell you, guys. Bloody, uh, yeah, coming down off Maligal, Mount Maligal. Uh, Homes, he come off the bloody, just going too slow. Oh, uh, let's show you this way. Going too slow and, uh, yeah, hit a big rock. And, uh, yeah, he tumbled down the bloody hill. Got his first scar on the new bike. So I'm pretty sure this must be the centre road. It's obviously well looked after. It'll deteriorate as we go further. <coughs> yeah, well, that's all easy shit. Yeah. So as we get further and there's some, oh guys, you're still with me, so, aren't you? You are? Yeah. Um, we've got some outs, we'll do some more, yeah, smaller tracks and stuff like that. Yeah. Here comes the guys. This thing at the moment, be careful with the dust, you don't know if you come across a little log or a... Yeah, 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 that's it. Right, right, guys, we'll see you further on. Bloody hell, guys. <laughs> We got to turn you guys on when we just got off that uh, centre track. We sent Nay ahead and it was a bloody good idea because there was a huge ass tree across. There was no way we would have got it through. So this is a nice little track. Nothing crazy but a little bit more, you know, challenging. Nice ups and downs and twists and, you know, got your ruts and tree roots. A bit of loose rock but not too bad really nice so I just see we're now halfway through oh hang on where do we go where do we go oh. I think we're still going ahead we've got Pete's on um, tailing Charlie I see him whenever we do stuff like this you know and I don't know who everybody's riding abilities Whoa, we're gone. Oh, I just went the wrong way. Don't you hate it when your little arrow goes off the track? We should have went down the other way. Yeah, so, you know, try and punch the guys up. Always make sure I see Pete. Every now and then, just in case, you know, someone comes off. You don't want everybody, you know, too far away. So we might Dickie's track. We must have supposed to take Dickie's track. Let's see what my little arrow does. Oh, he looks like he's behaving. Yep, he's following the blue line. Nice. Hey. All right, I settle down, Mark. Got a long way to go. So yeah, we should get when we get further down. You know, we we'll get some pretty, pretty cool. Um, views and stuff. There is a lookout that we're going to as a uh, t oh, tower, I think a fire tower possibly. Um, yep <laughs> Oh shit. Um, yeah, which will, I think, it looks like by the satellite, we should overlook the uh, Teddington Res Reservoir, which, uh, which is where we're camping. Right, I'm still on the blue line. Yes, guys, that's it. Beautiful. Oh, look at them all. Look at them all. That looks awesome. <laughs> Only all the bikes just, you know, the dust, multicolored bikes coming down a hill. Brilliant. All tightly bunched up. Love it. Oh, bloody hell. Right, eh? We'll see you further up, guys. We're just about going to come out. Oh, old Miles will keep you on board. Hopefully Nay's stopped at the right spot. So Hal's new to uh, riding with us and he's new to 
off-road camping. You know, back in the day, you used to do a lot of off-road riding. Um, Des on the DRZ, he's, I think he said he's new. he was new to the off-road camping. And it's a brand new bike, so it's all a new setup and all that kind of stuff. I'm frantically trying to see if I can see Nay. She's either gone past or not as far. So, <clears throat> hang on guys. Alrighty, I just, uh, I went back, which was not very far, Mark, you're missing your friggin' corner. Sent the all other guys forward. I just heard her on the, uh, I heard a bit of noise on the bloody UHF. So I'm presuming she's, uh, it was only a really short distance. Now I'm going, where the hell is everybody? <laughs> oh dear. So yeah, she obviously went straight through that first intersection. Um, and now she'll be going until she gets to another one. I'm presuming everybody followed Holmesy because I sent Holmesy the way that we're supposed to be travelling. Yeah. No? No. The finder? No, because it was really short. It was just over the thing. Oh, okay. So she must be. No. Yeah. Where the hell are ya? I kept driving, and I only drove for like seven minutes, and now I've hit a T intersection, so I've stopped. Right, right, okay, so you went past the, the intersection. Yeah, you would have by accident. It was only like 500 metres. <laughs> cool, all right, we'll, we'll see you there. You didn't tell me it was that close. No, because I'm a bastard. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Right, eh? So where's the rest of the guys? Are they going forward? No, I am up here by myself and these guys follow. So they didn't come out of that? No. Did nobody leave a, a... What did I wait for? You were on the corner though. Did you leave your corner? You're a bad man. Yeah, sure. I can't do that. And I should have told you, <coughs> should have explained to you. You've got to come, um, you've got to come back. You've got to see you've got to come back, back So I reckon someone can come off. Yeah, I think you're right. So, does this come to a T intersection, Mark? Yeah. I'll go out and see no. Yeah, I'll, I'll sort these guys out. At the end, they'll let her know they're looking for people. Yeah. Okay. What right. the fuck is that thing? Why won't that fucking thing go in? No, you you follow. You just go to the T to T intersection. You follow me. Okay. So you've just got to stay here. Yeah, I'll make sure. Well, I'll meet here until you. Stay just there. leave everybody here. Yeah. Um, so the problem is they've either gone that way, right that way, or they've come off. Yeah. So, yeah. so I might, I might, you've got to stay here. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So I'll do that first.
good to go. <laughs> good to go, right, eh? Hey? <laughs> Dr. Phil. <laughs> so we are recording. Yeah. Mark in action here. Oh, uh, that's it. Hold, oh, put your finger on there, bud. Oh. So, what happened? You just um, coming down the hill. Yep, right, I've got it. I went around the front, I let the front wheel go around a rock and the back wheel caught it. Yeah, this yeah, one. Right. Right. Uh, I could feel it. No, I can't feel it. Get your it um, bucked me off, yeah. and then I felt the bike land on me. Oh, so the bike landed on you? Yeah, on my leg. Oh, is that how you got all that? Yeah. Oh, shit, right. Yeah. Yeah. So lucky he'd gone back to pick up the armour, Yeah. put it in his pants. Yeah. 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 Where's the bark missing? Can't see it. Yeah, it's nothing serious. Trying to find it. There we go. Are you going to lose the leg? Nah. <laughs> yeah. He's got one on the other side. He's got a spare one. So. <laughs> he might cry. Yeah. Yeah. No, what's great with the handbrake? You won't scratch that one up again. Oh, I've got it's all double padding now. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> no, the bike, I think it's just the steering looks feels off. So you threw yourself under the bike. So this yeah. tradesman is blaming his Not tools, is what I'm hearing. I had to save the bike. What a bench of bars. Yeah. Alright, I hold that. Done. Oh, look at that. Mummy. <laughs> Brand new. <clears throat> Make sure you blow that bit out. Yeah. yeah. Or enhance it or... Yeah, I was going to yeah. say that. <laughs> Photoshop. <laughs> So Holmes, he's heading off? Yes, I was the first one. I just wanted to get it out of the way, yep. and now my day is mine. But have on. a look at this. Check this no, out. My look day at is mine. I've oh. had my turn. Look at this, guys. Look at the damage. It's not brand new anymore. Oh, something to remember the ride from. Yeah, so uh, Mr. Bolton, I think you've got a cost to repair. <laughs> Warranty. I think a bit of white silicon or sort that. What do you think, Bob? Well, so far, I haven't had any offs, but I've come close a few times. But, um, yeah, it's been great. Good day. Absolutely fantastic. Full of everything. Absolutely great day. Fantastic. Well, let's go and see what else. Hal, how are you going? Bike's going all right now? Yeah, really good, but no tracks, which are but odd names like Dickie Track, because I nearly lost it on Dickie Track. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, so if we got anything uh, worse than Dickie Track, not going there. <laughs> How are the handlebars? Do they... <laughs> okay. Oh, well. We'll, we'll have a look at that before we go. Yeah. Right, hey guys, so we're uh, starting to get uh, a bit more higher levels and stuff, which is good. Still on me blue line. Some views out there. There we go down, oh, down and up. Oh, a little bit skatey. Bloody, oh, Maxis has got bloody plenty of pull. Pull up somewhere here, and I'll try and get the uh, get the guys on the other camera coming through. Well, 
so far the tracks have been good. Nothing, to, uh, nothing too crazy. And when I plotted it out, I made sure I tried to stay to the, you know, fairly decent tracks as much as I could. Yeah, the guys will be lo will love this uh, section as they come through. Section where are my oh we wait oh this will be coming to the uh oh yeah there it is there's a fire tower I just heard a noise in my helmet from the UHF so what I might do I'll get up here oh, Maxi Someone must be on channel 26. Right, eh? Gosh, she's a bit bloody uh, windy up here. <coughs> so can you see the res from here? Should be should be somewhere down there. Is that the the, the res? Chaddington res? Yeah. Whatever's where? over underneath the rock, that's where everyone goes. Oh, that's for this a GA cache, right? Eh? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Uh, that's mold now, it's probably way out in the distance. Yeah. yeah. You can see that, that's mold over there, Mount Tarangao. Oh, right, yep. Oh, yeah. Rightio, guys. Cool. A bit more of a look here, and then we'll bloody jump back on the track. <laughs> oh, Jesus, Mark, where the devil are you going? Right. I forgot we're going down this bloody bit of a descent. I guess so concentrated at times. I forget to bloody go. Oh, this is cool. The guys would like to see this coming down a bit of a steep descent. Oh, nice little track. Just, there were some rocky sections. Oh, ah, like this stuff's nice. It's just when you're on those steep descents and you have the you know the larger rocks. But nothing too crazy. Whee. Oh, where are we going? Oh yeah, we'll just go around I think. We'll check. We're still on the blue. So what's gonna happen now is uh, there's a shortcut to the res, but I've made us go around and we're gonna actually come across 
the Teddington hut first and then we'll go in from there to uh, the res to the camp spot. Yeah, cool. Really good. Right, eh? Oh, actually, guys, I normally do the... So this is a Saturday. We took off. We're supposed to leave at 10, but it was well after 10.30, I reckon, because uh, how Spike was playing up. But we made sure we got him going. Well, he got himself going. Um, gave him a good chance to get it going before, you know, going to see you. <laughs> um, so it's good. His bike's still going brilliantly. Yeah, so it's Saturday. Let's say we left at 11 o'clock. It's now 3.55 in the afternoon. Currently 30.8 degrees on the bike. So she's warm, but we're not, you know, we're not doing gnarly stuff, so it's, uh, you know, you, you can handle it. Uh, I reckon we're going to go this way. This is where it gets a little bit tricky, and then this way. So I'll drop a corner, man, here. you have to drop there. They can't hear me, but they get the drift. <laughs> Righty a Cool. Yep. <laughs> yep. Opa. Couple of tree roots there. You got to watch them. Did you see them? And you think, oh yeah, tree roots. They can really throw you at times. Whoop. Down a gear, Mark. Come on. Nice. They'll be having a bloody <laughs> ball jumping around in that jeep. Wow. Right, eh? We'll see you further on. Right, eh? So we just uh, had a bit of a catch up there. Everybody's come through. Bloody nay. Oh my god. Oh, shit, something's in me fucking helmet. I don't know what the hell that is, but it made a horrible noise. I don't know, like a big bug. Bug. I got a bug or something. Made a hell of a noise in me helmet. because a pack of roos just went through there. No, no. Turn. Right, I don't know. I didn't see a bug. But, uh, might have been the camera made the friggin' noise. I don't know. It was weird. Freaked me out a little bit. So we're about halfway from the fire tower oh, to get into the camp. So it shouldn't be too far. Hopefully we just don't get any gnarly downhill shit. So far this track's really good. Nay obviously handled the bloody, all that stuff. She said she's not even in four wheel drive. Every time she'd think, oh I better put it in four wheel drive, she was already halfway up. So yeah, so Nay's doing real well. Right, I think we go straight through here, yeah. Cool bananas. All right, we'll see you further on. Righty, so if uh, everybody's got down off the uh, mountain, oh, what happened? Shit! Not too do one. Oh, bah. His goggles. Hoopa.
you had them when you stopped here? Oh, sunglasses, right, eh? Cool. Might be better if you're in first, Mark. Oh, <clears throat> are you guys with me? I have no idea. Yes, you are. Right, eh? How are you doing? <laughs> Excellent. Right. Oh, look, there it is, right there. Brilliant. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so it must be one that you can stay in. Righto. Eh? I've actually put in there. <laughs> He's doing, he's on the GA stash. Hash, no, cash. 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 So, obviously, we can, uh, there's a, you can camp here. They've got a toilet. It says a shower, but there's no running. You've got to bring your own bloody water. So, this is uh, Teddington's uh, hut. I don't know what the, uh, maybe inside will uh, tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, I was really worried about that last bit coming down because it had what the, <laughs> the four-wheel drive only. But the other stuff going up through there um, was worse than the four-wheel drive section. So, crazy. Right, eh? Oh, there you go. Then we'll left some stuff, laundry liquid, two rooms. Old shutters, look at that. Hut with a view. Yeah. Can even do washing. What? Can even do washing. Oh yeah. Cool. Oh yeah, look at that fireplace. So yeah, in winter that'd be a great spot, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, or if you got stuck out here for whatever reason. Yeah, hikers and stuff, yeah. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah, cool. Just make sure you sweep the floor before you go. It's just manners. Oh yeah. Brilliant. <laughs> Well, there you go, guys. Teddington Hut. So what will... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So what we'll do is we'll head down to uh, where we were supposed to be camping at the res and uh, we'll make a decision of whether that's a better spot or this spot. Because at the moment, this is a really good spot. But uh, it might be better over there. Who cares? Right, so how was that? That last buddy, uh, good, all that last bit, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, really good, but I'm knackered. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hal was saying the same thing. He's bloody pretty knackered. But really enjoyable. Great fun. Yeah. yeah. I, I think I might upgrade from a queen size bed to a king. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, all right. Yeah, I'll make a note. <laughs> Holmesy? I'm just happy. Yeah, that's it. We're so close, We're so, so close, close to opening up a can. Cold tank water there. If you oh, is it? Have a wash. Oh, brilliant. Cool. Oh, Righty-o. We'll head down. Pete's already headed down to have a look at this uh, res. We're all going to toddle down, make our decision which one's the better spot. Thought I'd get in behind bloody uh, homes and suck some dust <laughs> like poor other buggers. Yeah, so this has really turned out a pretty, it's been a pretty good track. You know, pretty easy and then just a few, you know, just gnarly enough. You wouldn't call it gnarly. Just enough to, you know, keep you on your toes. Bloody close. Oh, yeah, nearly there. Ah, oh, the joy of motorbikes, eh? Bloody brilliant. Oh, yeah, we're down in here. Yeah, it's quite a big area. 
Where'd Pete? Oh, there's Pete over there. <coughs> yeah, there's heaps of bloody room around here. Still can't see this res. Someone's actually got a boat. A speed boat? No. Oh, it's not a boat, it's a bloody canopy. <laughs> what an idiot. Yeah, look, heaps. Tons. This is, seems different. So this is the lower part of the res. So I don't, yeah. Interesting. Boat ramp. So I might have to go for a bit of a ride over to have a look. Righto guys. Righto, we found some water. Not much. And obviously we, you can't camp here, there's no camping. But we thought we'd just uh, come and have a look. Must be. I'll go around and have a look. Yeah. So basically, we'll be just camping back at the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. We're, we're, we're going back there, yeah? Yeah. So yeah, go for a wander, but if we're not here, just go back to the hut. Um, we'll just camp at the hut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's the better spot. Yeah, sure. So we've seen the water. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I think we just head back to the hut and then people can go fucking yeah. riding around or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Well, I'm just going to take a photo and get this back out of here. Yeah, well, we'll meet you back at the hut. Yeah. It's just that main, yeah. main road. Yeah. Righto, guys, so we're camping at the hut. Yep. yep. So if you want to go for a ride, take photos, whatever, again, we'll meet you back at the hut. Cool, the original one we went to. Yeah, Beautiful. just on that, get back on that tar and then just follow it till you hit the hut. Okay. Cool, Bajul? Yeah. Quite nice. It is actually. Lose some water. Yeah. Right, eh? I'll meet you at the hut. Yep. Yeah, yep. What's the time? Fuck it, it's two. <laughs> five o'clock, 501. <laughs> Hey guys, time to crack the bloody Jimmy. What do you got? Carlton Dry? Carlton Dry. I'm alive again. Cheers. Cheers. Bloody brilliant. Beautiful. Oh. Cool. Well, that was really good. That was yep. bloody good track. Started out easy and then progressively got. Yeah, it did. There were some challenging bits. Yeah, 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 definitely. Especially with the dust and the rocks, a bit of everything. Yeah. No, you did all right. Didn't die, so I'm the winner. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Right, guys, we got a bloody. Uh, I'll finish this off. We'll uh, then set up. The guys are already starting to bloody set up their tents. I'll give you a bit of a spin around. Oh, bloody just tons and tons <laughs> of room. <laughs> right, eight. We'll bring his out later on. Morning, guys. How's it going? All right. We're all packed up, sorry, I haven't done anything. I don't think I did anything around the campfire because I'm an absolute bastard. But we've got to do Bob's DRZ 400. The fellas are standing around because these are all the early guys that are all yeah, packed yeah. up and bloody, yeah, crazy bastards. 
Right, eh? Hey. Take me. Pete. Yeah. yeah, get rid of that so we can see this. See this thing. So, brand new DRZ 400. It was brand new a few weeks ago. Yeah, Mark. not so brand new now. Yeah, inspired by Chappie. Yep. Um, but yeah, I'd sort of put a few things on to make it Bob's bike. But we've got uh, the old Mark designed. Tool tube? Tool tube with special brackets I made up there, oh, mate. Oh, you got nice ones. Yeah, yeah, look at that. Did you make that or I did you? Did. Wow. And, uh, I went to the school of spray painting by Mark. Yeah, right. Yep. And uh, <coughs> went to Bunnings and uh, did all of that. Brilliant. Um, we've got uh, tail tidy, got LED lights oh, yeah. that are um, supposed to be unbreakable. Yep. B&B uh, &B rack. Uh, Barrett racks. So, so, yep. Yep. Rax, then you've got your... Uh, B and b carrier, and then the top plate as well. Yeah. Or back, back rack. I was trying to think what the... Bloody, yeah, the back rack and then the yep. luggage rack. B and b frame protectors. Yep. B and b B and bs bloody good, uh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> B&B covers on both sides. Yep. I've got... Uh, a connector here so I can actually charge my battery or use the compressor. Yep. Pump tires up. We've got the um, Safari tank. How many litres? That's 17 litre. Same as Chappies, just Same black? As, yeah, just black. Uh, we've got the uh, Wolfman Enduro bag. Gold plated, just due to the price. Absolutely. What is, how much is that? Because I know. $270. Oh, 200, that's not too bad yeah. actually. I was debating whether they get the Nelson rig or this one, but I'd yeah. seen this one fitted. I like the way it sort of tapers, yeah. Yeah. so it's all good. On the front, we've got um, VPS guards. So they're my favourite guards because they give you plenty of room with the levers. Why is that VPS? It says Barkbusters. It is, but the style is called VPS. VPS, right. Yeah, okay. So they yep. are Barkbusters. <coughs> cool. Got the screens for bikes. Yep. And... Um, You've done that. What have you done? Is that PVC pipe? No, no it's actually it? uh, rubber stoppers, door stoppers. Oh! Solid rubber. So I oh, that's a bloody good idea, yeah. you know, being rubber, yeah. It's debating whether I cut this in half and bring it down a little bit so that the actual screen comes forward. But oh, yeah, right, it yeah. Worked fine. Yep. I've got a screen here that'll stop anything, hopefully. Well, uh, that, that thing will bloody stop a kangaroo, mate. It will. It will. <laughs> Got uh, steady lights, uh, they're like floodlights. Um, and mounted on the another quality product by B and B. Oh so that's B and B, right. Yeah. Same with the the fender mount is B and B as well. Yep. So uh, on this side we've got the Suzuki radiator guards. Yep. Um, and um, and you were saying that you're not using the rear mounts. Yes, I found them problematic. So the rear As... mounts where the tank mounts to the frame, I'm not using that yeah. at all because uh, servicing the bike, you want two bolts out, unhook the back, tank off. Exactly. The other way was awkward because the brackets were just yeah. terrible. Yep, as we all found out. <laughs> yep, I've got a uh, Suzuki bash plate. Oh, this, all right. This bike came with a box of bits. It's a Cape York edition. Oh, so okay. I've used some of it, um, not all of it, but um, got yep. the frame guard here as well. Yep. And is that is that is that stock or is that an add-on? That's stock. Yeah, right. That's stock. Yeah, and this one here. Actually, part of the uh, Cape York condition is uh, just a downturn exhaust end, and it does actually quiet it down a little oh, bit. Oh, right, so yeah. I, I don't don't mind that one. Yeah. Um, and then on the dash. Oh, this is yeah, this yep, is cool as the dash. I've got a quad lock, and this one's got the dampening mount on oh, it. Oh, that's it, is it? Yeah. What do you reckon of that? Uh, well, I haven't tried it because it's dusty. I had the phone in my pocket more oh, so. Oh, okay, yeah. But I, I'm hoping that it's as good. I put it on other bikes as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the dash, I've, um, I've set it up, kept the original ignition and made a bracket and it, it bolts straight onto the top of the... Um, Triple clamp, the, whatever. The, yeah, yeah, I've got bar risers in there as well. Yeah. But they're the standard caps, so they're flat. So yep. this plate fits flat. Yep. And then... Um, this switch actually activates the driving lights. Yep. I've got that independent so that if you need the lights without yeah, the bike running, yeah. go for it. And then this one here on this side, it's got a, uh, a weatherproof 
USB, two oh, ports, yeah. Yeah. and then you can turn that off and on whenever you like. Oh, it's got the voltmeter in the middle. Yeah, such a professional bloody looking job. Yeah, so I was pretty happy with that. And also with the LED indicators, as a lot of people know, uh, I've put a new or the modified relay <coughs> in there. And I've also done the diode, diode thing. thing, yeah. Uh, so the single indicator globe yep. is the cause of all the problems when you get yeah. the fourth indicator on. Yep. And um, you can disconnect the globe and it works fine, but yep. I, I like it working. So it, yeah, I'm the same. I've got yeah. the diode set up, put it in, easy to do, and uh, it's uh, it works fine. Yeah, but cool. So they're happy. stock bars, aren't they? These are stock bars. I'm yeah. debating. I got a I got a set of Pro Taper bars at home, and I'm just debating uh, how they mount because some of these mount points actually have locator pins in them. Yeah. And so the new bars don't. So you've really got to get the position right. So these are all in the right spot, and then work out where you drill the holes. So yeah, yeah. Or just take the pin off. And yeah, it's, it's better if you do. Yeah, yeah. it's I a. Like oh. to keep it Some people don't like to drill a hole in their bar and. Yeah. yeah. But they, these are all right if I if they bend, then I've got the others. The to others play. to put them on. Yeah, exactly. That's so, it. So that's it. Mate. It's been a project over the last couple of months, but uh, this is its maiden voyage. Yeah. Bush, so it's done all right. It's done a whole um, 391 kilometres. Oh, really? Wow. And it's dirty. Yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. So that's it. Excellent. Fantastic. Oh, all right. the other thing too, yeah. I've put in heavier springs in the front. Oh yeah. And a heavier shock spring so that it can cope with this weight yeah. and all of this weight. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And, uh, so far. And have are they the, they didn't come with those wheels, the tires? They're standard. The oh this because part of that Cape York package That's or the new model. Oh. Um the tank had stickers on it which are a little bit different than Chappies, but Yeah. The, but these are this is the oh, new gritty. Model that came in. What are they called? Gritty E D O four or something, is that right? Gritty. Yeah. Yeah. I think oh, they're, yeah. they're Bridgestone tyres. Oh, they are too, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah right, cool. But um, th they were good yesterday, not 100%, but I'm playing with pressures as well. Yeah. Pressures and weights. Yep. But uh, very happy with it. Brilliant. All right, thanks, Bob. No worries. Great. You're you going to say something else? A great trip, and I've added this bike to my collection. Ah, cool. <laughs> thanks. No worries. Also to Chappie. Yeah. Right, are we all packed up, are we? Yeah. Cool, you're heading home? Yeah. Injured. Injured knee? Yep. Yeah. A bit sore. Oh shit, what happened there? I've still got a bandage on. Yeah. Not bruising. Oh, look at all the bruising, yeah. 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 It's a bit swollen. It'd be interesting to see. Don't do it, but yeah, on the backside and that too, yeah. Yeah, that'll be bad. So John's gonna head out that way, there's Tar Road, and then he can shoot straight out and miss all the stuff that's up that way. I don't know what we're gonna encounter. I believe it should be no worse. In actual fact, I reckon it'll be better than some of that stuff that we did. So we're, it should be sweet. But you just never know, and when you're not bloody, when you've got feeling crook, and yeah, you don't have your full capacity, you bail. Right, eh? Hey. All set, Hal? Yeah, yeah, the newbie's ready to go. Excellent. Yeah, Everything's been cleaned up. We've left no mess behind. No. Got any famous words? Only tracks, isn't it? You'd You've done heaps of GA, bloody you and you and yeah. Nay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's collected quite a lot of. Uh, there's three here, and we. GA caches. And then there's another two along the way at those lookouts that we went to. Yeah. yeah. So we got five yesterday, so it was good. Yep. Yeah. And Holmesy, you're going to have a video. It will be a video. Some uh, cooking dinner last night and breakfast this morning. Did you do the crumpets? I did, I did do the crumpets this morning. Cool. And I uh, did do a dinner last night, so I'll put something together. For Excellent. Sure. I'll be very keen to see it, and I'll put a link in the description mm -hmm. to that video. Not a problem. Brilliant. All right, hey, Bruce the Jeep. There's May. She'll hate it because she's looking lovely. Oh, I'm looking luscious. More than lush. <laughs> counting the cups for you, though. Yeah, Are you what? Counting, counting the cups. The cups. Make sure, sure they're, they're all there. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> cool bananas. Cool bananas. Rightio, guys. So we're on the track. I just got all the guys to go in front. Tell them uh, we're just relaxing at the minute. Taking it easy. It's 
to go slow so I can pass you. Hey, Pete, on the DR! He's on the DRZ! Dez, I said Dez, that was Bob! This is Dez on the DRZ! Hell on a DR650! The old DR's dominating this trip! And then uh, Holmesy on the KDM! The Orange! <laughs> right, eh? Cool! Thanks, guys! Now we can pick up the pace a little bit. So I believe we're on the centre road. One of the main ones, so it's nice, easy riding coming through. But I don't know further on what we're going to encounter. I'm pretty sure I made sure it was going to be fairly easy on the second day. Nice little track actually, nice windy, like you could really hammer it through here, but uh, you know it's nice just to, look at that, look at all the cockies flying through, looks really cool. Wallaby Dam, <laughs> yeah it's nice just to take it easy, whoop -ah. and uh, you know, take in the scenery, just relax. And then before too long you start, your brain starts going, right, hey, give it a bit of a rip. Whoop, hang on a minute, which way are we going? I think we're going straight ahead. What's that? Chimney track. Uh, I think we're going to have to turn. Chimney track or not? Just wait there! I just want to see on this bloody first gear mark. Yeah, wrong way. Wrong way. Oh, shit. Round we go. <laughs> Up this way, apparently. Yep, it's following the blue line. Looks like we're already going to get start getting into a bit more technical stuff. As I'm going along, I'm always you know, going right, yet yeah, the Jeep's still going to be able to get through here. Let Max just bloody tractor up this shit. First gear, second gear, get a bit more speed. That's the thing, it's a uh, fine line sometimes when, you know, when you're going too slow, that's when your balance, uh, it's a lot harder to balance and you're more li liable to uh, come off. When you've got a bit of speed, you know, the, the bike balance, you know, wants to stay upright, but with a bit of speed also it can kick you off. <laughs> Oh, it's still going up. This is cool. Nice. Uppity, uppity, up we go. 
now a bit of a chance to look around. Second gear, a bit of momentum going. Yoppa! Alright, hey, I tell you what, this is turning out. I didn't expect it to be as good as it has, the tracks. I don't know what I was expecting, but it's just been a really good good combination of easy and then just a little bit of, you know, a little bit harder stuff, just like this. You know, where you can come unstuck, but, you know, if you're doing everything right, you, you, you're sweet. You're not chancing shit, really, is what I'm trying to say. As long as you ride right, you're sweet not where you're having to try and bloody send it to get up shooting bloody you just you know, hope and pray you go bloody hit that throttle <laughs> and hope for the best yeah really cool I love it the guys behind they should manage all that and when you go up you've always got to come down Boom! Right, hey guys, I'll uh, <coughs> see you a bit further on, but I won't just let go of the handlebars at a minute. Just get up this bullshit. There we go, right, hey. Cool bananas, look at that! Uh, we'll just do first gear, tractor up, whee! Nay's not going to like seeing that when she comes to it. I reckon I've been on this with a Jeep, me and Nay come through. So I remember seeing this and it looks so daunting, but then when you do it, it's like, oh no, this is really cool. You know, it's nice and smooth. It's just, you know, a bit steep. And not as steep as what you first think it is. So she'll do that, no worries. She'll just might have a bit of a, holy shit. What the hell have they got me into? <laughs> She's doing really well. That last bit of the, the tight hill climb section. Uh, she, yeah, she says she was getting a bit bloody nervy. She was shaky. <laughs> but, I mean, she's, she's doing what most, like, a lot of, you know, wives or, or women, you know, won't do. Obviously, there's a lot to do, but, yeah. So, she's bloody all weekend. She's just done everything. As. And we're getting all these great views. So this is the centre road, this one. Here comes Pete. Coming down. Over all the bloody whoopses. <laughs> yeah, so not only are you dri you're bloody riding this, you're driving the Jeep as well. some four wheel driving as well, how good is that? <laughs> oh, here she comes. Sorry? There she goes, she's pulling through, she's not happy about it. Yeah, the old four-wheel drives, they just can't go the same speed as the bike. Oh, she's made it. Now I'm going to wear it. <laughs> that was the fingers. Hello, baby. If it wasn't for Pete, I'd still be back there and I would have rolled it off the cliff just for fun. Oh, really? There's no way I was going up that 
The was first, that, that the first hill freaked me out, and I went, yeah. no, and then I thought that was a big one, and then I got to the next one, I went, no, freaking way, uh, no. Alrighty, we're on a better road now. Yeah, that's what you keep saying. Oh. Each time it gets worse. <laughs> Rightio, so we got Nay, so Nay's made it to that road. She's actually now gonna, um, because I don't know how much more shit we're gonna bloody cop, and she's pretty much at her, you know, wit's end. So she's gonna drive on that decent road out to Red Bank, and then take the normal roads around to Moonabal, and she'll meet us there. So uh, there was a smile on her face when that was worked out, so that's good. And now we can just bloody hook along. Well, not hook along, just, you know, plod along. But obviously motorbikes are way faster than a friggin' Jeep and Nay doesn't have to stress out. Win-win everywhere. So this is Centre Road. Centre Road crossed over that whatever that one was. That's cool, righto guys. Hey, how's this? This is cool as. Look at that. Bloody brilliant. Loving it. This is a pretty good track. Nothing crazy. Sick of me here, you hear me say that. <laughs> yeah, the guys will be loving this. Good track, good view. Windy, up and down. Rocks aren't too bad. Chucker in first, chuck him in first, chucked her up. No. Second gear, hop, 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 yep, hey, up we go. Nice. Third gear, give him a breather. Good shit. Right, eh? Idiot, we just come down a gnarly section and why the hell did I not film it? All the guys made it down, no one come off. Yeah, it wasn't as gnarly as the bloody, you know, the chappy ones that we did at uh, near Mount Cole, the Pyrenees, but it was still one that, you know, you went, oh shit. <coughs> yeah, that's the whole thing. I, Bloody coming because it just comes out of nowhere, and Mark goes into survival mode and forgets to bloody turn the camera on. So now you guys are going, Oh, yeah, sure, Mark, it was steep and hard, yeah, right. It's not real unless you video it. <laughs> I reckon we're pretty much we're way down now. There you go, Max, a bit of a run. Oh, the guys are loving it, are loving this track. They're all saying this has bloody been awesome. And just to pluck it out of, you know, last minute, up to one o'clock, mapping it out, you know, you don't really, you don't really know when you're looking at maps. But uh, it's really worked, so I'll definitely uh, do this again. Righto guys, so we have made it out of the uh, Karakara National Park. There's all the bloody bikes lined up. So that's the Moonabel Resort. This is a tiny, tiny little town. 
This is the uh, the general store. So we've stopped here, bloody having some lunch. So pretty much now it's all tar. So how do we go, guys? Yeah, cool. Fantastic, Mark. Good shit. Yeah, well done, really Mark. Good. Excellent. Excellent. Pete, yeah, we, great tracks. we didn't die. Didn't die. That's no. that's nice saying. I didn't die. <laughs> Yeah, he did. Oh, he's a know. he's a good bloke. Yeah, I got I got to do some four wheel driving. Yeah, that's it. That. <laughs> Righty, eh? Good job. Remember, guys, keep on riding, and if you ain't riding, keep on keeping on. Big shout out to Chappy <laughs> <laughs> and Bones. Right, eh? Just as a bloody side note, they said, "What the hell's on your friggin' boot?" It's like holy crap balls. Poor old Max. He shot a. Uh, He's shot the bloody uh, oil seal. She's uh, spewing out. Oh well, I'll get aim on that. 